Hello everybody, my name is Shretex and welcome back to Star Sector. I was going to start the episode when I was a bit cl close to our bounty target, but I just left the star system and there's a bunch of random pirates everywhere. So I was like, oh, we're just going to kill them instead. It's totally fine. So, ah, uh, uh, even though they're in combat, they still managed to screw me over by just indirecting my fleet, but that's okay. So this is quite a big pirate fleet here, but in the reality, everybody, we have some pretty big allied units. Look at this, the Caesar class siege battleship. That's a big ship, everybody. That is a big ship. So, let's join the battle and see what we can do. Uh, let's see. I'm going to deploy everybody. Oh, uh, no. Do you know what? We won't do that. We'll just deploy the main forces, which are now not going to include these little guys. I probably should mess around with this a little bit more. Maybe we're not deploy this as a main unit. I'll deploy it. Just for this battle, we'll use it, but not normally. <laughs> so, I want to try and keep the unit two guys being like the backup ally. And the unit one's guys that are going to be very good at fighting. But we're just we're going. It'll be fine. Where is it? Where is my brand new siege frigate? It's actually quite small, isn't it? But we have seen it in combat before. It is pretty badass. Oh, that is a big... Oh, there's an ally in front of you, man. Don't you care? Caesar doesn't care. <laughs> he just barges through them with no uh, issue whatsoever. Look at that big gun. That is a big gun. I don't think you can describe it in any other way, everybody. That is some big daka daka. Let's even kill some. Oh, it's actually the first time you used in combat my brand new ship, by the way, my Praetorian. Oh. <laughs> Juicy. Let's see if we can get some kills ourselves. Oh, I love the firepower of this. Though it is a bit of a shame that no time when it fires, it's really, really slow. <laughs> I might actually get rid of the um that's dead. I might actually get rid of the targeting subsystem so it moves at a faster speed. Because otherwise it would be quite a bit faster, actually. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, it's my fighter squad. And the kind of broken falcon which I, I scavenged to get myself the uh, Solaris cannons. Get that though. Oh, that's a really hurt shuttle. Yeah, so I killed your torpedo with my cannon, sir. I love it. Oh, this is so much better than the other one, everybody. Oh, why hello there. I like how I panic so much I turned my shield off. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Ah! Why would you do that, man? Okay, I'm not gonna lie, guys. That kind of sucks. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to get hit in the back by my allied siege frigate. Maybe someone should uh, revoke his license or something. I'm oh, not like this. Wow. I don't know what on earth happened there, but it was pretty wild. Okay, that guy is way out of there. Uh, <laughs> I think that guy has the... There's a variant of this, which I saw earlier, which makes it into like a repulsor cannon, which sounded pretty fun. But it, I, I prefer to have a giant rail gun for my own one, but it does sound pretty cool. There you go, it repulses enemies. How cool is that? If you want to play a galactic level ping pong or um, pinball, you can in this game. Let's keep moving up. I don't think this uh, this poor pirate navy really knew what was going to happen when they started this battle. <laughs> what is the... There's lightning? Have we got four on our side now? I don't even know what's going on. It's the Emperor, everybody. The Emperor protects. There you go. That's what I want to see. That was my version. Just a giant railgun of doom. Which kills anybody nearby. Okay, they got their big ship left. But that's pretty much it at this point. This siege unit is very long range. Well, I guess it is a siege battleship. I shouldn't be too surprised. I'm being hit from behind from my ally again, aren't I? I can see that. I can see hit my shields. Someone needs an eye test after this battle. Nice. I think we've actually done quite a lot of damage with our own units in this one. We may actually get a bit of a payout. The last survivor. Massively regretting all his life choices. I really want to hit him. No. Oh. Bit too far away. Eventually someone with a large gun will get in range of this guy and they kill him. Oh wait, I feel better. I got it, I got it, I got it! Nailed it. Excellent. Good job, everybody. That went pretty well. Oh, it's still alive. Sorry, I thought that was over. <laughs> oh, the enemy main ship's still alive. Oh, my God. 
I don't know how it's still alive, because what I just witnessed there was kind of ridiculous. Uh, oh, that was wrong one. I oh, shame they haven't got... Oh, I love it. You can get some a lot... This is this guy is definitely a long-range build. Like You can get uh, some pretty standoffish weapons in this faction. So he's just not using any of them. If you look at his build, he's got like point defense on the front. He's got high-velocity drivers. He is not... Does I will not build my ships that way. Don't worry, everybody. We will have it different. Uh, so that went very well. We absolutely smashed them there. Uh, let's just set my guys to maybe kill some of them. Uh, they killed a few. We'll take that. Okay, so... We got, like, a little bit of money there. <laughs> Not the most, but we got a little bit of money. Okay, let's head off to the, the Horrors of the Warp, and let's go and see if we can get ourselves a bounty. I'm pretty sure that's not... That's one of those stalker ones, right? Yeah, it's, it's not real, don't worry. It's not real. It's a figment of our imaginations. Now, this bounty we're going to go and do... If you look at the map here... We are going towards Beta Tears, which actually tells me directly where the enemy is, which really saves me some time looking. Uh, also, I'm kind of digging this, uh, this, this, this like Roman armor female thing. It's, I think it's unlocked something inside me, but that's, that's something for me to discuss later on with somebody else. So we're going to keep going this way. Oh, there's some electricity. Oh, I didn't dodge it at all. <laughs> I failed, everybody. Have I been in here already? I have. We've got. If there's a gate around here, we probably want to try and identify it and unlock it for next time. I'll jump into these random systems. Yes. <laughs> yeah, first time. We found a gate. Perfect. Is there any barren world? No, no, no. We want to find and colonize more worlds as well in the future so we can increase the size of our Imperium of Man. But at least in the future now, we can now go a bit further than we could before, which is pretty cool. So if I keep... Oh, actually quite far away. I thought we were a lot closer than we were. <laughs> so my bad, everybody. I'm probably missing a lot of stuff just jumping in, like jumping out of these systems, but... It is what it is. It's fine. Is that one of those... Alpha points? Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I think we found an alpha point again. But by mistake. No. <laughs> it's not. It's just a regular place, everybody. I've, I've made a mistake. Oh, no! Oh, no! 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 This is what ruined my my current system, everybody. This stupid thing. Damn it, guy. It's fine. The planet will protect us. In the planet we protect. Let me just... Uh, While well, I'm here. Class 2. Pretty bad. Is there ruins or anything? No. This is every single debuff known to man. <laughs> it's possibly the worst place we've ever seen. We have to wait for this to pass. Oh, it's going to take a while as well. I probably should have just... Oh, I know. It's, it's too late. I, I've been too cautious. I've really just gone for it and got out of the way. Wait, can I just do this? Oh. Well, bye, guys. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> Done. That's something, I think. That was that was a thing. I'm pretty certain of it. This guy's tracking me, which is interesting. No, it's not. It's also... Damn it, game. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I have more than one ship with broken sensors right now. So we're going to be getting a lot of those, everybody. Just don't worry about it. So keep going this way. A yellow super giant. They are pretty big. I mean, I think they are aptly named. Let's see what's inside here. Oh, there was a pirate base. Oh, there's pirates here. I'm kind of tempted to see if we can kill a pirate. Also, there's a desert world, which may be pretty good. So we're going to have a quick, we have a get quick gander over there. Oh, let's not go to. That is a big. A, oh, what? Is there a bounty here? I guess there is. Interesting. Uh, should we see if we can auto resolve it? Let's see if we can save myself some time here. Yes, we can. How much money do we get from that? 50k. Cool. Thank you, game. There is something over here. But what is it? That must be the pirate base. Oh, there's a lot of people over here. <laughs> oh no, what have I done, everybody? <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Don't panic. They just made us get visited by a lot of pirates in a few seconds. <laughs> there may be a lot, a lot of pirates. Okay, we're going to back up, everybody, believe it or not. We're going to back up. Hopefully, we can fight those two. No, they're not going to do it. They're not going to do it. Oh, wait, wait. It's okay. Those two together, we can do. And then we we'll go for the bounty artist. No! Oh, they're all here. Wow. 
Let's go. Okay, so it ditchy said 113%. So we've, we've won battles easier than this in at some point in the game, everybody. We can do it again. What I'm going to do, though, I'm not going to deploy a lot of these ships. We're going to keep them out of the battlefield. Especially the small ships, because we want to bring them in when the battle's already started, so they can come around the flanks and stuff. Uh, does that include these guys? Yes. Yes, it does. So we deploy the big guys. We go to the middle here, and we're going to do an assault. And these guys will be assigned to that assault command. We're not going to leave. We're going to defend this point, and we're going to die trying. So everyone go and do that. We've got Tom Cruise. We've got Maxim, and we got whatever your name was. I actually can't remember. No one knows. <laughs> it's not even important. It's fine. And once the battle starts, we bring everyone else in. They can start going for the flanks and stuff. What is this one? It's a sensor jammer. Okay, so that means we get ourselves some reduced enemy range, which is pretty handy. Oh, this is terrifying. Nailed it. Okay, so what's happening then? A shuttle's been spotted, sir. Get it. We're so far we're winning everybody. It's it's fine. We got this. Okay, the enemy actual ships are arriving now, not the <laughs> That was a brief moment of early victory. I'm sure it won't be repeated in a second. Another one. It's like a Star Destroyer. Which is probably gonna die. No. Yes. Okay, so that was some enemy ships down, but they were not really the main threat here, everybody. This kind of thing's going to be a threat, and wherever that other one is at the back somewhere. This. This is a threat, everybody. <laughs> okay, it'll be fine. What level was that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Level 9. <laughs> Why have I done this to myself? I made them stronger. Okay, they're coming in. So what we're going to do now, we're going to deploy the rest of the Navy. Everyone else come in. What we'll do is assign this guy directly to definitely defend with the rest of the units. And we'll assign the other guys. No, I don't agree with this at all, game. This is not the plan. We're going to assign you guys to go around the flanks. And if you can, take over their control points, which will make his life a little bit easier. Why are you guys not doing as I ask? Can you do as I ask, please? Or I will destroy you. Thank you. Okay. We need to relieve pressure. It's like popping a pimple. If we hit them enough, they're back off. This guy's going down. We've got him. He can't back up in time. He's too, he's too far in. Unless I shoot really slowly. Okay, he's gone. He's gone. Let me do a quick vent. So that was a pretty good start for us. So we still have the two big... That's a problem. It's gone off to the side and it's now locked into that... That guy's dead. He's dead. I'm sorry, guys. The plan was a simple plan, but the plan has failed. What's happening over here? Oh, it's retreating from combat. Okay, uh, that guy's put him back. Can you guys somehow go, like, away? <laughs> Just move away. The whole, the game resets my defense command is a bit annoying, everyone. I'm not going to lie. I don't know why it's doing that. Is it because it's changed to an assault command, maybe? That could be the reason. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure those guys on the right side are dead. Oh, no, they might drive past. Oh, he's out of there. Okay, it's fine. There's a few ships running around. That's an easy kill. We'll just get out of the way. That's an easy one right there. <laughs> oh, I got it. That's annoying. Okay, so far it's going okay. The enemy has kind of buggered off that way to go and stop the enemy over there, though. Which is okay, I guess. It's just um, maybe not good for our little allies over there. So, what if we can try and push in then, then? Let's go, let's go with our units. Let's try and push towards the objective. Let me see if we can make any gains here. I need to go over this way. That is a big menace. But then again, it's kind of distracted right now. Let's go for this guy instead. If I can get rid of that and force, that's a big blow for the enemy. My allies are not willing to go in with me, though, unfortunately. Um, that victor is going to die in a second. What we'll do, actually, we'll change this to a harass command, and I'll assign you to harass as well as you. 
One of you two harass the enemy. You guys got the objective. Nice. Okay, so instead, go over there and capture the second nav boy. And we'll try and regain this point in the middle here. The buffs are so good in this game for these control points, it's definitely worth capturing them. It's not even a question, really. And it does a really good job of splitting up large fleet battles into different areas, which I think is a really nice way of playing. That's bad. That's not good. So what we do now, we're going to do an engage command on that enforcer. We need this to not be happening. <laughs> <laughs> we need everybody that's not me to engage this unit as a squad. We need to keep this, these units together. Otherwise, they get split and killed. That is such a cool ship, everybody. It is an awesome ship. I hope that we're okay. I did tell him to pull back, but that carry was getting pretty close to that assault. Okay, he's okay. He's okay. Uh, so I had to keep pausing to look at the situation. You pull back. You guys got the objective. Okay, so move to the next one. I'm going to keep cycling them around and we'll just pick them off at like a little bit at a time. And what we'll do, if we're doing that, maybe we'll assign the second shuttle to also harass that same target. I think that'll work out pretty well. Okay. Nice. Good job, guys. i got no command points right now because I've been a bit uh, obsessive with it. So there's only one enemy in this part of the battlefield, actually, which is quite interesting. Um, those guys are doing a great job distracting. Those guys aren't doing anything. we got you got a new command point, though. We need these guys to attack as a group. The... Ah, oh, they've kind of... This is the problem, though, because they've now got the attack cruiser... And whatever that is, another attack cruiser in the same group, which is going to be really hard to deal with. It's going to be a nightmare. Ideally, I want to deal with one of them at a time. Oh, dude, why'd you turn your flux off if I was right there? <laughs> oh, it ran out. I was hoping to get a, a cheeky attack on the arse there. Okay, so... How do we want to deal with this now? Most of my fleet separated. It's not going to work out. I say we pull back again. And we realign on the, sa on the same point. So everyone pull... Uh, we disable these. Disable that. We'll keep that going. But that's fine. Everybody go and defend that point. And we'll re... Go over there. You guys... Probably help defend it as well. I didn't see why not, really. Okay, it's all back. We have to fight as a team. It's the only way the Emperor protects. It is the only way. Okay, here it comes. We're still a bit too far apart from each other, which is going to cause us some issues, I think, in a second. But we have got to a situation where the attack cruiser is kind of a bit far away from the rest of the, the other one. No, it's too far away, guys. I'm going to let this hold that for a second. I'm going to switch target and go for these really weak carriers. If we wipe out this, the enemy's lost all his air support. Oh my god. <laughs> nice. Next one. Maxus needs to pull back. It can't. Um, is it winning? No, it's okay. That might actually just defend it, actually. Oh, firepower! Purge the heretics! Ben? Okay, brilliant. So we've got a few shepherds. A lot of shepherds. And the, the next big guy. Oh, where did the other one go? Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's quit murdering my shuttle over there. Drawing how on earth a shuttle was being captured, caught by a cruiser, I don't know either. Uh, they're a bit more a bit of a distraction, aren't they, those guys? Like, we should kill them, but they are kind of just annoying. 
What we do... Oh, we can't do it yet. I was going to say I... Oh, perfect. I was going to just send those guys to go and kill them. Which is what they're doing anyway. Okay, next part of the battlefield. We've all regained, and there's two big cruisers. We keep going, we keep going. If you can hear the police, don't worry about it. <laughs> it happens, everybody. Ooh! Thread the needle. I'm gonna kill these guys with myself. Oh, oh it's so slow mode. It should still work though. It's fine, that guy's dead. Let's go for the guy behind him. Maximus disabled. I shouldn't be too surprised that fast that carrier was fast, <laughs> to say the least. Okay, dead, dead, dead. Next up. Okay, so we got... Oh, they kind of like... They're in the between us. But I think we're actually winning by looks so I guess it's the siege cannon doing some big damage there. I can't see what's happening though, which is really annoying me. I don't know what's happening, but go faster. Oh, that's going down. They got it. <laughs> it's just you. Is it just him? It is. Awesome. We lost some ships on the way, everybody, but we have achieved what I want to do. Go and kill that final enemy, everybody. Go and destroy them together. And we'll have a celebration party. Let's do this. I think it's trying to retreat right now. I understand the situation. This is where its speed is going to probably save it, though. I think it's going to get away from us, which is going to be a bit of a pain. Um, I don't think there's much I can do about it, to be honest. I haven't got ships that are fast enough to move towards the um, points in time to get a speed boost for us. I can keep applying pressure, though, but that's pretty much it. Oh, broadswords. Um, because it's got two speed bonuses, and that's why we're having trouble catching it. <sighs> I wish this is why I wish I had some frigates left. <laughs> we could have gone and captured the points. Oh, okay, screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it, screw it. Um, just do a capture command on that. You capture that. We can do this. No shooting. Get closer. It's okay. <laughs> okay, it's out of it again. Okay, no more shooting. Fast speed, go. No shooting, no shooting. And go! Done! We did it, everybody! That's why you probably want to get some more destroyers in your fleet, everybody. Because, as you can see, the Imperial ships are very good at surviving. The other ones, not the smaller ones, not so much. But, we did it. We uh, One guy survived. <laughs> Damn you! And that was the bounty target, so we failed the mission. Done. Ship recovery, yes. Uh, recover, cover. Recover. I know we're using a story point, but it gives us bonus experience, so I don't care that much. Done. That was awesome. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. We survived. That was a big battle. Ah. Oh. We got... That wasn't the bounty target? No, we're not even there, are we? Wait, I just realised we're not even... <laughs> This is some completely irrelevant bounty I just did. It's fine. Uh, that was awesome. That was fun. Okay, so we'll do a save there. What we do now is probably just... 
hide because <laughs> we're really hurt right now i'm just gonna float around a little bit we'll just let the guys heal themselves up and we'll go from that do you know what that's a lot of money can we do it remotely because yes let's get outside can i scavenge while i'm here better nothing i'll take it how are we doing though is there any reason for us to stay here, though? There is a desert world I want to scan, because it might be amazing. You never know. Okay, we're going to slowly slink our way over this way. And we'll see what happens. There's some kind of vessel here, but I don't know what on earth it is. Hyperion class advanced gunship. That sounds fun. What kind of ship is it? Oh, well, that is an advanced gunship. How much is that like a super high level frigate? Phase teleportation. Interesting. I don't want it, everybody. No, 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 we won't. We, I'm, I'm, we'll leave it, we'll leave it. It did look pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie, but I don't think it's. I'm sorry, buddy, you're gone. Okay, level up again. So I said we're gonna go for this one, right? Increase cargo capacity, fuel capacity, and personal capacity. And also, all civilian ships move faster. Pretty damn handy. So we'll go for that. I think we're killed enough now to actually move on at normal speed again. So we'll go back to that. Let's have a look at this. Tell me your secrets. Class 3. Ah, oh, bit of a bit of a stinker. But we can use the ruins, though. Uh, we got solar shielding. And whatever the hell this is. Stitch beam lance. That sounds interesting. <laughs> I'll take it. Look at my cargo pack. How are, can we ask how this actually works in practice? How, how are they doing this? <laughs> how are they? Oh, we got double capacity, sir. But but how? How have you done this, man? Oh, there's a mining station next to the mining. Oh no. Is that going to be a big fleet? No, it's not. But I really want to get that mining station. If we kill... Oh, there's another one defending it. We'll kill these guys. I... S I said... We're... K no. No. S stop it. Stop. Thank you. No. What? How? <laughs> the speed, though. It's over. It's over. Okay, we kill this guy off. We'll deploy the main team. Team, team. I'm so proud of my main team. Some pretty good units. Oh, these these guys are screwed. <laughs> I don't want to be that guy. Oh. Very awkward when you have to manually shoot and also... <laughs> we, we, it's okay, we survived. Oh, I messed up. Ooh. Nailed it. It's fine. I don't know how good these missiles are, but I don't want to hit me anyway. Oh, it's okay. I'll keep dodging it with my amazing pirating skills. This seems like it's a troop transport rather than a military vessel. I'm not going to lie. Oh, it's shooting a lot of missiles at me, though. Please, point defense. Don't fail me. It failed me. Ooh. You see. I ah, you won't believe me, guys. I literally right clicked as it happened. I was like, I should turn off my sh uh, my shield. A bit too late. Yeah, the constant missile spam is pretty annoying, but it's over now. It's dead. So problem solved. Uh, let's, I, I would flux, but there's a missile chasing me. So we've got a few enemies left. Let's go and finish them off. Okay, perfect. Super speed. 163 speed. Oh, this ship is so good. Okay, enemy down, down, down. Wow, that was a good... <laughs> Catrick. Oh, there's one enemy left. Sorry, I thought, I thought we called them all. Well, it's definitely going to die now. 
Well, maybe not. We need to replace these guys. They do. They seem like they're doing stuff, but they're not really. I mean, yes, I have killed the wolf, but it took like two squads. <laughs> James, stop smashing the button, man. <laughs> it's so fun. Ah, oh, didn't work. Okay, so we got some cool stuff there. We'll take all that. The main thing is that we got to stop any pirate that can potentially tag me when I'm trying to get to the mining base. That's the main thing we're trying to avoid here. Because it doesn't matter how good they are. If they tag me while I'm touching this thing, it's a big problem. I would just... Okay, screw it. I think we got it. We got it. Ah, ultra rare ore deposit location. So we got... So I can, oh, did I, I thought I already had that for some reason. Who knows? But we got it again. So we can now have converted hangar bays. And we have way too many concrete stuff. Let's also do a quick double tap. And we got nothing of interest. But it's okay. Okay, so I think we're going to head out of here then. Let's keep going towards our actual objective, which I keep forgetting about. <laughs> we'll figure it out one day, everybody. It's fine. This is only a pre-pre-bounty. Need to find some lands that have um, the warning signals. Because, of course, if we're making our own empire, everybody, we need to find ourselves a nano forge, uh, which we don't have right now. Oh, there's a black hole we can potentially visit. Let's have a quick gander at the black hole, shall we? Is this going to be a real black hole? Kind of. Uh, Baron Bomba, Gas Giant, and Fr Ooh, this, this may have the beginning of an interesting world to colonize. You never know. It's got three stable locations. It has a black hole. Not that really does anything, but it looks cool. There's also apparently something here. Ooh, a, ooh. Oh. <gasps> yes! We've unlocked the ability to always have the elite package. That's awesome. Ah, oh, That's hype, everybody. That is hype. So, of course, th this increases your speed and everything. This is, like, the cooler version. It does reduce weapon range a bit, but... Eh. <laughs> eh, everybody. We may consider that one. Frostwing, I'll take them. Why not? Uh, we've got Nav Relays. Very cool. Converted fi Fighter Bay. What is that? Oh, that's the reverse. I don't want that. Screw that. Tandem flux grid. What? It doubles the effectiveness of vents and capacitors. Oh, it can only be installed in it. Oh, okay, well. Fine. Be like that game. I'm just going to take all of these. I don't really care what they are. I'm just going to take them. Oh, these aren't even blueprints. Sorry, these are LPCs. <laughs> totally different. Take all that. Give me your secrets! Volkov Battle Cruiser! Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Mostly, if it gives me a chance to say Volkov more, I'm, I'm all for it, everybody. I love that word. Okay, so. Fast four. No! Oh, it's got some L's here. I was hoping this would be like an amazing world we can colonize. But alas! It is not meant to be. Did you hear that? Because <laughs> I heard it. There's something there. What is it? I don't know. Wait, wait, let it get closer. And then we'll zoom away. Wait, wait, get over here. Get over here. That was a pirate. Of some description. But what kind of pirate? Oh, that's okay. We can kill that. Yeah, we can kill that. It's just totally fine. I was, I was thinking it might be like some kind of deadly death thing. Very imaginative of me. Uh, let's do this. Yeah, it's an easy battle. Easy battle. Uh, we'll probably do exactly the same. I like the strategy I did last time where I deployed the units afterwards. So we do exactly the same thing again. We deploy our guys into the center. Oh, I forgot to look at the elites. Like, to be fair, you can't do it without a shipyard anyway, but it may be better to switch off some of our ships to be the elite versions. Even if it reduces CR, it makes them a lot better in different categories. So we have to have a look at that. The Elite Phase Ship. Oh, can you imagine? Well, we haven't got to imagine. We can do it. 
But then, uh, can you imagine fifty percent reduced CR on a ship that only has like ten seconds CR anyway? <laughs> It'd be a bit crazy. Bide our time, men. That's bide our time. Oh, there's a strike coming. I don't think it's going to survive the power of the missiles, though. Or maybe it will. And I'll be completely wrong. <laughs> That's a bit too risky, bit too risky. Especially because there's an enforcer here. Okay, the enemy is kind of spread out already. Let's just deploy everybody, screw it, it'll be fine. Uh, everyone spread out, do your thing. Switch that over to a capture. And what we'll do, we do an engage command on the enemy's main ship, which I think technically should be this, whatever this is. But isn't that a freighter? Is it a freighter? It doesn't seem like a main staying combat ship to me. I'm going to say the main enemy is going to be this enforcer. So we tell my guys to attack the enforcer in general. And we go from there. No, guys, guys, guys. Let's, let's not do this, guys, please. It'll be fine. Okay, let's go. I can't remember if there's a, a ship trying to flank me with a gigantic cannon. Oh. You think your cannon's big? Mine's bigger. Is that another strike? Oh, gotta be careful for those. Gotta be careful for those. They could kill me. Okay. Do a quick vent. Oh, good hit. You guys got out the engines there. Oh, hello, Buffalo. <laughs> You're screwed. Oh, maybe they are a bit bigger than I thought they were. I need somebody to assist me with this. Um, what we should probably do with this. These already gone off that way. Let's get the... Oh, I can take it myself. It's fine. I don't want to mess up the rest of the fleet thing there. It has got a level 9 leader though, which is a bit crazy. Those missiles are really dangerous. Ben. Ooh, stay back, man. Stay back. Ah, uh, he's gone. I don't know how I feel about that. That could be dangerous. What we'd do... We'd tell these guys to switch to... Oh, there's a strike there as well! No! Okay. You guys engage that strike there. We'll do a... We can't even do it. That's too far away, isn't it? That's more than 4,000 meters away. Harsh dick bag! Yes, everybody. That's what the game says, not me. So, um, that's a problem. <laughs> That is a problem, everybody. That is a problem. Let's get rid of that mission. Let's stop messing up the AI a little bit. Let's let them do their own thing. Uh, what we could probably do... I want to save that ship, but it might win by itself. We'll, we'll see if it wins. It has a good chance. It's got the ability to control time and space. And I think it can use that ability to destroy the enemy. Oh, I thought I killed it. No, no, it got away. Come on, damage. Seep through. No, it's away. It's, I, I messed up. <laughs> no, wait, like I said, this is not a combat ship. Definitely not. No. It looks big, but it's not dangerous. Maximus disabled. I was wrong. I was wrong, everybody. The Maximus could not handle the strike. The strike is a ship killer, though. If you lose ships to pirates, it's probably going to be due to a strike. Or one of those pirate cruisers, which are also pretty good as well. I'm not happy about this. We need to get someone to move off with them. Um... Do that. I don't think most allied ships could take on a strike at that level, to be honest. 
Also, I had a level 9 commander as well. It wasn't even a basic strike. It had like a super saiyan god guy on it on their side. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Ma making the office even better than before, it makes it a lot more interesting, everybody. The AI gets a lot better with like, high-level units, that's for sure. Okay, they've identified it. Uh, also, the shuttle's over there as well. What we could probably do, actually, we can probably do like a general engage command over there. And we'll make sure we assign these guys to that mission. And we'll reassign the shuttle to take over the base. Uh, apart from that, I think we're okay, actually. We're going to let the rest of the AI do what they want here. The ship, like, literally on inside me. <laughs> Damn it, man. It's like a, it's like a tick. I'm going to vent under the guise of this carcass. Did that kill that by mistake somehow? Nice. <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, let's finish off this guy. You do realize that point's mine, right? You, you can't have it. I'm sorry. Get your own point, man. This guy should be out in a second. My flux is getting a bit of a problem though. Screw it. Nice. Okay, there's still the enforcer, which may cause us a problem. Especially because it's currently looking at the enemy. It's just it's just oh no, wait, that was the wrong one. We need to change some stuff around, guys. Change some stuff around. You guys all engage this target here, because I'm not happy about a random siege destroyer fighting a, a guy with a hyperdrive thing. No thank you, a uh, hyperdrive uh, afterburner. It's okay guys, don't worry about it. I, I will assign auto-retreat commands between episodes, I promise. <laughs> oh, he nearly got hit by that. Come on! Nice. Good stuff, so guys. Good stuff. We're good. Okay, perfect. Oh, that's such a cool weapon. Are we done here? Yes, I think we lost, like... What did we lose? The shuttle and the cuss and the Maximus. Which we can recover. I'm going to leave the shuttle dead, though, because it's just... Don't really eat anymore. We've, we've moved past that point. Look at all these level ups. Okay, let's go to the level up screen, shall we? What do we have here? Maxim, you are now going to be given. Uh, ooh, what do we want? What do we want, though? I'm not a fan of most of these. Hmm. Guess that's like the best one there. Oh, I don't know. Two fluxuspation per ordnance point spent on weapons. That will help out in combat. We'll go for that. That's a general one. The bigger the ship, the better it's going to be. I think it's fine. So that's that guy leveled up. We also got Tom Cruise level up as well. Uh, helmsman for sure. Not even a question. He needs Helmsman. Uh, and also we got... Uh, it's Aquinius. Cleveland. <laughs> Gunner implants. Awesome. Oh, something else as well. Uh, combat endurance. That could be very... Oh, oh no! There's two! We need them both! Uh, uh, they go for the, the combat endurance. Because it inc includes increasing the maximum CR. So they can last for more, more engagements in a row. And if they have a high amount of CR, they get bonuses to like aiming and stuff. So it is pretty handy. Okay. I mean, like, right now, if you look at mine. Okay, that's not a good answer. I'll pause it. <laughs> Damn it! It should be better than that, but it's not. 
eventually it will say auto fire accuracy excellent or something or like perfect i can't remember what it says but it does go up it does go trust me trust me everybody trust me okay anyway i don't know why i know if that was even about to be honest but we did it anyway so we got that sorted out let's continue going towards the actual objective of this video We are losing a lot of supplies right now, but we did take a lot of damage there. Oh, do you know what we should... No, I don't want to... I'm not risking that. Where is it? There. Okay, so while we're running around as well, I just want to put a look. I'm pretty sure I can't change it in the middle of jumping around the solar system. No, I can't. That's a lot of changes. <laughs> so I'm just reading the thing there. What does this do? See, I think this one's going to be better for that ship. I think that I reckon we should give that a shot on this. We'll see, though. We'll see. Also, I'm very curious right now. I know we can't even activate it, but I am very curious to see what it does in this. Uh... The Magna Foreman arcs to weapons and engines when it hits, dealing extra EMP damage. Hits on shield a chance to generate a shield penetrating arc based. Oh, that's pretty cool, man. Th like I said, this faction with this mechanic is really cool because it really does change all the ships based on what you're doing. Because like that one also increases speed of removability. I reckon it's. I reckon that's a. a I reckon that's a worth it. But we'll see. We'll see. Anyway. Let's go this way. Let's go to the actual objective. I feel like I'm going really slow, but I'm actually moving at nearly maximum speed. <laughs> Is there... We need to find a gate near here so we can come back whenever we want. One of these systems surely will have a gate. Oh, there's Ludic Path here, apparently. Which is interesting because there's no planets. So I'm not sure how that's possible. Is there a Ludic Path here? I don't know what's going on there. That's weird. Oh, I'll let them deal with whatever they're doing over here. It does say path to... It must be on the asteroid belt somewhere. But why do I care? Wait, I'm leaving. <laughs> why do I want to go and fight a pirate base right now? I don't... I just don't want to do that. Uh, gate here? No, it's just another empty system of sadness. Okay, so... There was actually some kind of fleet that drove past us there. This is apparently where the, the bounty is going to be. So what was the... It's been a long time. It's been... We just got a bunch of modified freighters and overdriven destroyers. Oh, that could be a bit of a problem. <laughs> It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Um, interesting. No, we leave it off. We leave it off. Okay, let's go inside, everybody. Let's do this. Another Gludic Path base. What is happening? Why is this place so cursed? Okay, we're going to ignore them for now. We need to take down the bounty. But we're never going to get anywhere in life. Ow. Let's hope that... Is that them? Why, hello there. Dawnma. Dawnma. Okay. Let's do this. To be fair, this is a pretty... It would just... Everyone come in. They're really, really far in that way now, but it's fine. Wait, when I deployed these guys, they appeared from a carrier. Even though the battle already started. Interesting. Well. <laughs> that hammerhead did not do the correct thing there, everybody. That was a bad time for that hammerhead. I need to back up. I want to get out of the way of my falcon. I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay, go. Yeah, I got to do commanding on this one, everybody. It should already take care of itself. Unless it's that ship, maybe. Maybe that ship will die, but... Oh, let's be careful, let's be careful. Being pushed by that guy. 
I'm really happy that I managed to get this ship, though. I know it's only a destroyer. I will get a better ship eventually, don't worry. But at least for now, this is a really fun ship to play around with. Oh! I thought I turned my shields off! I must have got the wrong way around, everybody. I must have turned them on when it was low flux. No! How has this happened to me? Oh, we are... I should have been paying more attention, everybody. We are in a big oof. We are the oof lord of Star Sector right now. They're back online. Oh, they got... They got so oh, not hit those missiles. Somebody help me! Why are there so many enemies? Did I deploy everybody? Where is everybody? They're over there. Look, guys, you need to help me. <laughs> I need help. I know I'm taking damage. I know, I know, I know, I know. But if I flux right now and I can't fire back, they're going to kill me. No! Okay, we got it, we got it. We got that as well. It's okay. Return fire. Wow, that, I was, do you know what, I was complacent because it was like, oh, I don't know, I've survived this episode, it's totally fine. And then I just do that and die like a complete idiot. So, <laughs> it just goes to show that this game is very terrifying at all times. You should really never really not pay attention, or that could happen. Whoa! Why would you do that, man? I've been cursed. I've been cursed. It was going well, now it's just over. <laughs> I can't believe I just witnessed that. That was out of order, man. I can't believe that. That shuttle's dead, man, because of you. You did that. Well, I'm pretty sure I need hit him as well, but still. Oh, <laughs> that was a good hit. Okay, guys, you haven't got guard me anymore. I'm fine. You can do whatever you want. I am really hurt, though. Um, I like how we're taking more damage from ourselves than the actual bounty target. Well, well, that's not really true, is it? When I say ourselves, I mean my incompetence and the siege destroyer murdering its friend. That's what I mean. Come on, guys, finish it off. Let's just turn off all our... Uh, let's go maximum speed. Okay, nice. Uh, there's one enemy left. There's a, oh, two enemies left. are just flying around randomly. Oh, I'm so hurt. I don't know how to explain the mechanic about this battle, man. It just... There was... If they go... Well, let's, let's do a lesson learn after the battle and see what went wrong. And I was like, it was just me. I just sucked, man. It was just nothing else about it. It's just me. I... Everything that I did was wrong. I mean, look at Tom Cruise here. Tom Cruise has no damage at all on his ship. Clearly, the problem lies with myself being the pilot. That was the problem. I reckon we can get that guy before he gets away. We can get this guy, it's fine. Maybe Tom Cruise can get the guy. Nice. Okay, survival. So not only did we survive some ridiculous battles, we also managed to get ourselves the bounty I decided to start the battle. Oh, Maximus died again. No, Maximus. Why do you keep doing this to me, man? We got the target, at least. It's fine. That is a really damaged ship at this point. <laughs> we must be getting close to leveling up, surely, because we, we are getting there. Next level up, we get the thing that automatically repairs demods, and then we never have to worry about taking damage again. Well, we do, but I mean, at the same time, it would just repair itself. It's fine. Uh, wait a second. Why did I not pick this? Is there any reason for me not to have that? Because I think... <laughs> why not, right? Why not? That's my answer to everything. Done. Bounty achieved. Let's get the hell out of it. Was there a gate here in the end? No, there's not. We've got a little bit of time there. Let's just spend a few minutes see if we can find ourselves a gate and we'll go back to uh, base if we can. No, I'm leaving. Screw you guys. Nope. I've already left. It's too late. 
Because also there might be places we can find some cool worlds as well. So I definitely want to try... Who are you guys? Oh, just enemies. But they're not attacking me, so it's fine. Uh oh. I thought I got away with it. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I definitely didn't get away with that. I'm now just firmly inside the death there. Okay. No game. There, wait, there is AI here? But I didn't see a warning beacon. Maybe it's not exclusive to that. Ah, right, so we will do this. I mostly need to find a gate so I can teleport back home. That is my main thing right now. That's what we really, really need. No! Not here, though. <laughs> we need to go places, but not here. Not here. That... That means you'll die. Just so you, danger level high is wrong. It, danger level doom, everybody. Danger level doom. Maybe this place have one. I bet that other place has a gate though. Ah, oh, no, it's not here either. There's a lot of worlds here though. Is there anything interesting? Uh, I'm not screaming at me to be honest. There probably is a good world here, but I just don't want to scan them all right now. Is there people here as well? They're all over the place. I guess we are quite away, far away from the um, center of the galaxy, though. I hope that we. F I'm really worried about not finding a gate now because we'll just be stuck out here forever, never be able to return. Well, I guess we can just fly back normally. But apart from that, that's, that takes time. Derelict ship. Now I want a gate, guys. I want a gate. There's an arid world with some something there. That could be good. Oh, look. Extensive ruins. Ooh. And we'll have a look at those at some point. For now, though, there is stuff. There's actually people inside here as well. This is not just... There's something... There's a, there's a fleet here. It's alive. Oh, that's cool. We've got an administrator. I'll definitely take that. Yes! It's the best version! We got it, everybody! Excellent! Okay, I'm definitely happy about that. That is... I love finding that. Oh, wait, this is a really bad. Give me a second. <laughs> no ore! No ore. Cataphract, LSM. I'll take that as well. Why not? More the merrier. Class 4. It has no hazard. It's just a place that you can go, which is pretty cool. So we'll we, we get this at some point. This is a good place to go. Uh, I also why I'm here. I'll take that. What is that? Volkov. No, I keep saying it. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Damn it, me. Gotta stop it, man. Just stop saying that word. Might have called my child Volkov. Just so I can say it every time. <laughs> I, I haven't got a child, by the way. Nor do I. Am I going to get one anytime soon? <laughs> That's just a, a weird thing I just said. Uh, I can just get a free salvage rig. I'll take that. Oh, oh. oh I've already got that one. <gasps> Volkov. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I've been looking at the, uh, the the retention rate and it go down by like 100% in the last 10 minutes. Let <laughs> me just say Volkov. Yes. Yes. Tracker swap. Oh, that's pretty cool. Ah. Oh. Advanced optics. Expanded crew deck. Reactive armor. Some kind of factions fighter. Don't know what it could be. It could be anybody's. Who knows, everybody? Who knows? I can't say it anymore. <laughs> I've, I've banned myself. There's no more to saying about that thing. So I actually, it's been a while since I've actually had one of these. I actually cannot remember for the life of me what on earth the salvage rig actually does. I'm not gonna, I, I literally can't remember, I'm sorry. Um, probably tell me in a second. Increase the resource gain from salvaging abandoned stations by... Oh! Oh. That could be pretty cool. So it literally just increases loot. I thought it was something to do with repairing, but that may be maybe like an older version of the game. Um, because it's been game has been out for a while. At one point, I'm pretty sure it was a re uh, like a fast repair thing. But they must have changed that at some point. Why are you running? Why are you running? Fun. 
get out of there. Ciao, everybody. I'm gonna I'll, I'll mess around a little bit and see if I can get back to base. If not, I'll see everybody next time. Thank you for watching this very random episode of me surviving horrific odds and also saying Volkov for like 50,000 times. If you want to start a drinking game about that, feel free, but I probably will say you'll probably die in a few minutes, so I wouldn't recommend it. But thank you for watching, everybody. Have a nice day. Goodbye.